Hey guys, Clandor here, and today I'm doing another unboxing, and I have, you know, I have someone here to help me out with that, and, and that person is Dog Meat. He's here to help me unbox, bam, the <laughs> Fallout 4 Pip-Boy edition. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Man, when I pre-ordered this, I had no idea it came in like a packaging like this. This is like the bomb diggity. You get it? Bombs. Follow. <laughs> okay, now that... <laughs> sorry, me. Now that I started this video off with like the worst joke ever in the entire world, and I got that thing off, which was harder than it should have been because it had stickery, stick, sticky stuff on it. Whatever. <laughs> I'm over it. Oh, dude, this thing is just... I did not realize this was going to be so easy to open, though. I kind of almost don't want to open it. It's just sort of like the anticipation of it. I don't know. But let's just... We got we to gotta do this. Oh, I feel so good doing it. Uh, don't take... Don't, please don't take that out of context. Please, just, just calm down. Calm down for dog meat. Do dog meat. So cute. Anyways. So, now that it's open, we have, oh, great smell. This is easily a 9 out of 10, if not 10 out of 10 smell. A 10, 10 would smell again. Uh, we got a bunch of plastic, a kind of a excessive amount of plastic, but uh, it's it holds some stuff in it, I guess. That's cool. Bam, get rid of that. What is this? It's just, uh, it's just a manual of... Oh, that's so cool though, but like it has, it, it's like, it's a setup manual, but like, it's like Fallout style. Ah, I, I like that. That's cool. But, uh, okay, so first off, we have the Fallout 4 steel bookcase with all, with all the goodies inside of it. We got, um, uh, the nice steel bookcase right there of the Enclave soldier, well, not Enclave, the power armor. I just associate the Enclave with power armor. Because you know that's what they were war in Fallout 3, and we have uh, all Fallout 4 season pass. I dropped it. <laughs> I dropped it. Uh, Fallout 4 season pass, but not really. It's just telling you, hey, there's a season pass, and it's like an advertisement thing. Let's just get rid of that. And then we has, <sighs> and then we has a very cool poster of like the Vault Boy and like. The million different iterations of him. That's pretty neato. And then we have the manual, the best thing ever. It comes with a code of Fallout 3 on the back that you all just saw, but I've already redeemed it by now, so there's literally no point in trying to redeem that. Uh, but look at this amazing manual. It's got buttons. Yay! The only good thing about this is that it comes with a freaking code for Fallout 3. And then we have the inside of the case. It's a workshop thing. And then, of course, we have the very last thing that everyone, that like everyone, the, the, the coolest, like one of the coolest things ever. Isn't that right, dog? We, like, wolf. He, he's a dog. He says wolf. Like, what, you, what, what did you expect him to say? Like, come on. We have, oh, 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 yeah, this, and we have a stand for it, yeah, more exciting than the actual thing, one second, and there you have it, the actual Pip-Boy, oh my gosh, this is so cool, oh, it opens up like that, and you just put your arm in there, oh, I really hope it's not like too small, that would be so disappointing, but this is so cool. Oh, and like, as some of you may or may not know, oh, you can turn the little dial thing and it actually moves things around. Oh, those are the power buttons. In. <laughs> so cool. Oh, there's so many. You can like turn every knob. Oh my gosh, that is just amazing. I don't know if, if the knobs actually do things, but it's still cool. Uh, but yeah, as some of you may or may not know, you can actually put your phone in here and have like it just right there and it like does things I'm not quite sure how you do that but it's still cool uh, I'll just have to figure out how to do that sometime oh, bam and there you have it it's all uh, attached and equipped and 
ready to go. It is kind of a little tight, which is a tad disappointing. Uh, I am also wearing a sweater, so that might that might have something to do with it. But it's my uh, it's my Vault One 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 sweater. Can't can't go into the wasteland without it. This gives me stats. Maybe not the best stats, but you know stats nonetheless. But yeah, I could just go beep boop bop beep boop. I don't know. I, I I honestly have no clue how to get the phone in there. Uh, but uh oh, did I just did I just break it? Oh, uh, um, thought it was a button. Doesn't seem to be a button. Whoops. I already broke my cool new collectible. Uh, and there's a disappointment on my face. Uh, well then, that's the dial's turn. Ah, fun unboxing. How could this happen to me? I made my mistakes. Got no. I have no clue how to fix that or even if I can fix that but yeah this is still cool I'm glad I have it uh, just won't look at that ever sorry uh, this is supposed to be a high generi high energy blah uh, high energy or whatever words or are supposed to be uh, let's take this thing off before I break it even more Huh? That's probably a good idea. Let's see. Let's see. Dogby wants to use it. Come on, you want to use the the vats, right? No. Okay. You're, you're just uh, propping the dumb joke. Gotcha. Uh, just, just all your goggles are coming off, huh? Puppy. Just there. Yeah, whatever. That's good enough. They can cover your ears. You know, ear goggles. Have you never heard of those? Uh, but yet, uh, just don't go dying on me because I don't want to reload the last save because that was a long time ago. Uh, I know I could save right now, but whatever. Uh, but yeah, this is so cool. I am ready for the apocalypse now. I can just use this and use vats and stuff all the time. So ready for it. And, uh, oh, heck, I could use this for everyday life, you know? And just walk down the street, get into the thug fight, BAM! I'm wearing this. It'll help my arm get punched and it won't hurt as much because it's kind of thick. Uh, okay, but yeah, this was the Fallout 4 Pip-Boy Edition unboxing. Thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope if you got your own, you didn't break it like I did. Be sad about it. Oh, that was a button. I honestly thought it was a button you could press, but it doesn't seem to be a button. But yeah. Thanks for watching again, everyone. Hope you enjoyed the video. Tune in next time for some more Fallout 4 stuff. I'll definitely be doing some more videos of it. Uh, leave a like, comment, or subscribe if you want. It always helps out. And as always, stay classy.